hosts and three times winners Arsenal join Turkish champions Galatasaray in bringing the curtain down on the sixth edition of the Emirates Cup. The last time these two met in a cup competition was 13 years ago when a penalty shootout victory earned Gala the UEFA Cup their first major European trophy. Picked by Arsene Wenger, who's looking for his fourth Emirates Cup, has made seven changes to his team from the one which started the 2-2 draw against Napoli. The name which stands out on the team sheet is new signing Yaya Sunogo, who makes his debut. The rest looks familiar, including Santi Cazorla, who's making his first appearance of pre-season. Galatasaray show five changes from their victory over Porto in their opening game. Again, another name stands out. Captaining the team today is Emmanuel Abue, the former Arsenal player who joined the Turkish club from the Gunners. Didier Drogba, who scored 13 goals against Arsenal during his time at Chelsea, starts on the substitutes bench. Fernando Muslera, very calm and composed in the Galatasaray goal. It was he who made the save from Jackson Martinez in the first half of their game against Porto. Which went some way to giving them victory. Mistake at the back early on. Sonogo on the ball. Sonogo shoots and it's saved by Muslera. And literally, with his first touch inside the first minute, Yaya Sonogo almost becomes an instant Arsenal hero. Oh, what an opportunity that is for him early on in his, in his career. Ramsey, it's a return ball from Sonogo, uh, Cazorla, back to Yaya Sonogo, Oxlade-Chamberlain finds him again, tall rangy figure, Gibbs, Ramsey's in there, goes down under a challenge, he cries for another penalty in this tournament, and now Galatasaray on the counter-attack, good work by Bakary Sanya, very lively start to the final game of the Emirates Cup. Yes, yeah, complete contrast to the first game. Now Arsenal really got at him from the first whistle. Here we see the appeal for the penalty. You see his foot, he's kicked a foot Aaron Ramsey. You've seen them given. But uh, here we see Sonogo involved again. Here we see just as he goes to kick, he just gets crowded out for me there. I think that was the right decision from the referee early on in the game. Shadow of the roof of the Emirates showing up on the pitch. Wilcox in! Oh, my word! Should that have been 1-0, Stephen Hughes? That was a delightful ball over the top. Arsene Wenger scratches his head in disbelief, as do the fans. Well, I can't believe it's not. Aaron Ramsey, fantastic crossfield ball. Picked out his friend and teammate, Theo Walcott. And we've seen him in this position numerous times. Takes a great first touch out the sky, difficult to control. And we've just normally seen him flick him. And the only surprise, it hasn't hit the back of the net. It's a brilliant ball, great run, really good first touch. And he knew exactly what he was doing there, Theo. Just trying to lift it over the keeper. Cazorla finds Ramsey. Looks like Chambers drifted out to the left. Cross is good. Sonogo denied by the intervention of Aurelien Cejo. Ah, but the positive thing, Oxay chamberlain weaker left foot, first time cross as well, we see. So no goes in and around there. You can see he knows the runs to make, making a nuisance of himself in that box. Short corner, Arteta back to Walcott. Oh, it's gone all the way through. It didn't even need a touch from Pierre Mertesacker, and he's as surprised as anyone is. Theo Walcott has given Arsenal the lead as we approach half-time. I'm not sure he meant it, though. No, I'm sure he doesn't care, though, and nor do the Arsenal fans. You know, the ball's come back to him from a corner, and they always say at the right areas, and that's exactly what he's done. You know, defensively, they didn't really know what to do, Galatasaray, if you get something on it. The keeper's expecting someone to get on it per Matasaka. I think might have put the keeper off a little bit, and it's crept its way into the far corner. You know, he didn't mean that, Theo Walcott. You know, he's just looking to whip the ball into the box. You know, he's aimed for the far post and it's gone in and there he is celebrating. 
And lots of bodies in there. Sani Kazula's come from left hand side to try and middle of the park to join the play. Gibbs still going. Kazula. Sano goes offside. They wouldn't have counted anyway. And I think he knew. Oh, he didn't know at the time. He's come to a fall to his left foot, probably his weaker of the two. He's just stabbed at it. Sani Kazula joins in. Yeah, he's definitely offside. It's the right decision from the linesman. But it didn't count anyway, he didn't beat the keeper. He's, he's gone with his left foot, aim for the corner. The crowd are willing him to score on his debut. Abue through a gap to find Amrabat. Drogba's in the middle. Amrabat goes it alone. And almost managed to sneak it inside to Chesney's near post. Well, he's a dynamic player on this right hand side, Amrabat. This time he's got the other side, the wrong side of Kieran Gibbs. He's onside, we see it again now. And he decides to cut back onto his weaker left foot, get his strike away. All over the top for Oxlade. Chamberlain brought down brilliantly. Good one handed stop by Muslera. Oh, good play, Oxlade Chamberlain. This time he's wide left, he makes a good run. Well found back, Rissanu in behind the Bouet. Great first touch. Decides to drive into the box, the right thing to do. He's just a touch close to the keeper, he can find it really difficult to get it out of his feet. But good play from Oxley chamberlain driving into the box. Snyder now, here is Drogba, tight angle, still goes for goal. With few options available to him. Once again, another... We've seen that over the years as well, the ball gets thread in behind, he just pulls off the centre-half, the ball slid down the channel. That time a really disappointing effort for him. The Arsenal fans really enjoyed that. Drogba in the area, dangerous. To Chesney right behind it. Oh, we've seen him do that over the years again. Faint to shoot, cut inside. Ramsey. Crowd urging to shoot. Giroud will. Straight down the throat of Muslera. Oh, he done really well. Aaron Ramsey done well in the lead up to it. Drives into centre of the box again, zipped into Olivier Giroud so he could turn in one touch. Takes the defender out of the game. He's on his favourite left foot. The only problem is he's falling away as he's striking it. Arsenal come forward. Zelalem to Oxlade Chamberlain. Very strong running from the Englishman. Getting it all the way into the penalty area, good footwork, is that a penalty? No, says John Moss. Well, Oxlade Chamberlain might feel that his balance was taken away from him by the challenge. Here we see the Oxlade Chamberlain contention decision. Here we see he's trodden his left foot, and he's going down there. And I think th that's a penalty. And one thing you would say about Oxlade Chamberlain, he's, he's honest, he's an honest player. There he is, his right foot's caught, the error's right knee. And he stumbled, and he, in fairness to him, he tried to get up again. Referee's got a great view of it. He's right in front of him. We've definitely seen them given. Here we see it. And he's caught his right foot as well. For me, he's unlucky not to get a penalty there. Swung in. Headed down by Giroud. Muslera's is there. No real pace. Well guided, but not really going to trouble the Uruguayan. No, and, you know, it's very difficult to generate the power just from the header alone. Snyder goes for a shot, pushed away by Zaczesny. That really stung the hands of the Polish goalkeeper from the Dutchman. Well, you knew as soon as he took a touch on his right foot there, he was going to let one go. Fantastic striker of the ball. Snyder, Cholak, Snyder again. Dinks one in, Drogba over his head. Oh, the referee's given a penalty, has he? Well, well, well. I don't think that was a penalty. Here we see it. Didier Drogba, he's got his eyes on the ball. Mikel, who's going over the head all, all along. He's gone down far too easy, Didier Drogba. Didier Drogba is looking to score another goal against Arsenal. To Chesney to keep him out. He can't. Goal number 14 against the Gunners for Didier Drogba. Oh. And it's all square.
That's a very clinical penalty again. You know, he just waited for Chesney to go and he drilled in the other bottom corner. Technically, he's excellent at that. He's excellent at dead balls, penalties. You know, for me, he's won the, he's won the, the penalty. Walcott's free kick, Matasaka. Couldn't quite keep it down. What that does is, in terms of the Emirates Cup, is it puts Porto in pole position still. Because they would win it on goals scored. Riera lifts one up. Boots Amrabat. Sarioglu. Miss kick shot. Amrabat. He couldn't keep it down. Worrying moments for Arsenal. Almost a winner for Fatih Terim's team. Yeah, they've been a much improved team since Schneider had a drop come on. Here is Schneider. Dinks one in. Oh, drop was there. Did it drop but to win it? And he's done it. Who else? Arsenal just cannot keep this man down. Here we see it. He just pulls off Mertesacker there. Just enough space. Great first touch. And a brilliant finish. It was this first touch which made it. But trademark Drogba does it once more. Arsenal must be sick of the sight of him.